Hello there. Welcome to this table which I still haven't washed. Isn't it delightful? There's one of Pidge's feathers. You probably saw that last week because I don't clean my house. Seriously. I need help. Anyway, today we're looking once again at toy cars because we like toy cars, but unlike the last lot of toy cars we have, these ones are um, of a different time period. Yes, it's, uh, the charity shop has paid up rather well with this particular bag and I'm looking forward to it, but we, uh, we also have a comparison, a brand new toy car also from the charity shop. I'm sure that when I opened this, people would scream, No, that was the 1 in 100 super rare car! How could you, you heathenous English bastard? I don't care. But what I do care about is the fact that on a day like this, when it's rather cool and raining a bit, I like to have me some refreshments. Coffee, tea, snacks. Refreshments, mineral sandwiches. That's a sandwich which has dirt and stones in it and other deathly things. Hot pies and nothing on the back. Yes, it's a little tea and coffee wagon and you can open it and it's got a little thing inside. Look, 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 there's a hot water thing and there's a very old till and there's a spatula and a frying pan and an oven and the detail in there is actually really nice. Um, obviously, th these are in bags that I just open up this is really nice. The only thing that's a bit drab is the uh, the tow hook is uh, a bit naff, but hopefully that will still work. But yeah, a very strong start to this bag. Genuinely like that. Um, wish it was in slightly nicer condition. It appears that it's supposed to be... Uh, maybe there's meant to be a sticker on that side that appears to be a sticker, but uh, I don't know. But yes, refreshments. We still see these sort of things on the side of English roads, and they're very nice. Now, here's a kind of lorry that might tow that refreshments thing. In fact, would you tow it? Your tow hook? No, your tow hook's too big, so you don't get to tow it, but you might carry it like this. Yes, there you go. He's been a very naughty boy, and now he's being carried off to the principal's office. Yes, principal is a very American word, the headmaster's office, we say. Off to the headmaster with you, you naughty refreshments fan. No, no, sir, I'm sorry. Anyway, I've got the autofocus on, haven't I? Woo, autofocus off. It's a lorry. I think we've seen one of these before. It's a Mercedes. It's uh, Lesney again. Uh, that was Lesney, I'm pretty sure. Uh, we didn't actually look on the bottom. Mobile Canteen, number 79. Yep, this is made in England by Lesney. Matchbox Series, Mercedes truck. With a bit of chrome. Chrome's actually quite nice. That bottom bit is very well preserved. Yeah, it's a lorry. It's very nice. We like us a good lorry here and there. Wee, 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 wee. Now, you, you, you take your refreshments truck and we'll, we'll keep you in there until we find somebody who can tow the refreshments truck. Perhaps... Perhaps this can tow the refreshments truck. He said, knowing there is no way in high hell that this thing could ever, ever tow the refreshments truck. Because this is the Stones Ginger Wine, Victoria Station, Walhelm Green via Victoria, horse-drawn bus. Yes, it's, it's a carriage that is a bus. Um, oh, it's Lido. Uh, I think the horses have been drawn on with Tipex by somebody at some point. We're very common, I've said. You often find older toys are painted over and stuff like that because that's what children did with their time. Uh, but yeah, it's um, it's a horse-drawn carriage. Uh, the horses are ever so slightly above the ground so they can just roll along, which is quite a clever design, if you ask me. I'm not a huge fan of this sort of toy, but, um, you know, as a bus driver, this is technically one of the earliest kinds of bus going, and it's genuinely quite interesting. Benches on the bottom and seats on the top of deck. I assume these things existed in reality. Um, this is loose, so I'm assuming it's missing something from the top, but maybe that's... Uh, who knows? But I'll have a quick look on the bottom, and, yeah, it's uh, made in England by Lido. Uh, we don't appear to have a date. Can't see what that was. I'm going to pull that to my face. Days Gone. Ah, it's part of the Days Gone series. This is supposed to be 80s, I assume, somewhere in that region. It's quite nice. The wheels are... Uh... Yep, the wheels are fully metal. I probably have tetanus now. Uh, it doesn't move, you know, it would in reality, but uh, it's quite nice. But that would not tow the refreshments lorry. Um, maybe if it broke down, though, it could go in the lorry and then the refreshments could go on top like that. I love being a YouTuber. I can do some really stupid bloody things. Tiny van. Look at this tiny van. It looks like it's meant to be a covered lorry. It's maybe meant to have a cover on there or something that appears to have gone. But tiny, tiny, tiny lorry. Is this Lido? This is... Oh, this is Budgie. Oh, a Budgie model. The Tanker series. So this probably had a Tanker in it. Some... I've only got one other Budgie thing 
and it's a double decker bus that I'm looking at on my shelf right now near a dinky leopard anti aircraft gun and currently being crushed by some other toy because the shelf is horribly disorganized. I don't know much about budgie. I should really do some research. I have budgies though, and they're adorable. Two little budgies upstairs. They're total bastards. Always out of the cage, even though I don't let them out. Um, yeah, budgie model. Little tanker. It's all right. It's quite small in comparison. Um, yeah, we've got the balance act now. I've got to try and skip that on top of there like that. And yeah, there we go. So he's he's still on there. There we go. We've got four things queued now. Let's go to the next thing. Oh, oh, I've just noticed something. Oh my. Now let's get the um the bad thing out of the way, which is this. It's horrific. This Oh, is this gonna be like Action City? Teamster, damn it! Action City and Teamster. I'm pretty sure they're the same company, just under different names. I just noticed where my wallpaper's peeling. That's not good. Um Yeah, this is crap. I hate this. I, I, I hate this grating. And the screws again. I would take it apart, but I'm not going to. The axles do appear to be better on these ones than uh, other toy cars, but... Uh... Be gone. That's terrible. That's terrible. Officer Mustachio has come to check out the victim of the evil car who has, of course, been thrown somewhere into the garden. It was in the utility room. We'll probably stay there at this point. Poor car. Officer Officer Mustachio will support him with uh, love and compassion the way police officers do by completely ignoring the victim and driving away because he doesn't care. Mm, we love police officers. Nah, police officers are fine. Right, uh, moving on to the next object. We've seen one of these before. Uh, this News of the World London Transport Train by Lesney Toys. I wonder which company made this toy. Now, uh, we've seen one of these before. It had different adverts on it, but I'm pretty sure it was um, during the oh, Lone Star Loco review that I did. Um, it came with... Um, oh, God, it's really dirty. There's a load of dirt in there. It is has no interior at all. I don't know if that's meant to have an interior or not. It's Lesney, made in England by Lesney number three. So this is going to be a very early one. It's got tiny wheels and it trundles along. Ding, 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 ding. And then it, you know, there's a budgy thing in the way. Ding, ding, ding. And everybody dies and Officer Mustache comes along and goes, ha, ha, and then leaves. You know, all the normal stuff. It's uh, giving me gas, apparently. And best Sunday newspaper, News of the World, world record sales, not anymore, you lying scumbags. Ha ha ha. I was very pleased when that newspaper shut down. Bastards. Right, we've got three left. We've seen two of them before, so we'll get those two out of the way quickly. Uh, oh, it's Park Ranger. We've seen Park Ranger before, and we've seen this skin as well on other stuff. Nothing too exciting there. It's Matchbox, it's 80s, you know, it's Land Rover. It's all right, 1987. And it's another tractor. I think this is Maisto. Oh, no, this is a Matchbox tractor. You know, it's a tractor made in Thailand. This one might tow the... Uh... There we go. Now we've got something that will finally tow, and by timing, just kind of carry the uh, the refreshments trailer. It's, it's all right. It's, you know, it's a Matchbox trainer. And then when we want to the last thing, which um, I believe has had some paint scrape, which is a bit of a shame, uh, in the bag. But uh, this is a two-piece object. Mm, I'm just throwing the bag on the floor. Here's the first piece. And you can see the second piece in my hand. It's a little trucker, and I knocked the thing. It's a little truck with a toe, because you can also get the, you know, tanker itself. Now, when I brought this, I brought this a long time ago. This was actually still connected, but uh, you just kind of put it in like that, and then flip it over, and then it's not going to come off, because it's a little tow lorry, a little tanker lorry. Yay, tankers. Yay, tankers. And, you know, it's got... I think it's meant to say mobile gas on it. Um, yeah, it'll be mobile gas. Very, very worn out and well used. But hey, what do you expect from old toys from a charity shop? Let's have the, auto the focus on here. This is a Thorny Croft 2400-gallon trailer tanker made in England by Lesney. Major pack number eight, according to that. And I assume it's the same information on here. Major pack number eight, Thorny Croft tractor. Quantum tractors, not lorries, this early on in human existence. But yeah, nice little, nice little uh, tow 
two lorries, and uh, that brings our selection of objects to an end. These are everything that's on there. Um, and we do have these three things ready to uh, go. Stacking seems to be the theme, but uh, realistically, this guy has these things covered, so that's fine. Um, Oh, knocked the camera. That was clever. This guy appears to be quite capable of towing his own stuff. We can put the News of the World tram in the bodgy and go along with it, meaning that the only thing that really needs help is the trailer and the park, dude. And realistically, we could put that on top and the tractor could carry away this, meaning that for the first time ever, we don't need any of these transportation mediums. And this one is incredibly dusty. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> Bird dust, because they've also transported away, which goes to tell you everything you need to know about my YouTube channel. It's a waste of everybody's bloody time. But hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Tell me how you think this massive crack got in here and where the driver is, because he's obviously quite dead. And I will see you next week for some other weird and wonderful content. Ooh, wiggly fingers. Mmm. And a big scar. Bye-bye, <laughs> everybody.